Okay, buddy. This video teach you how to rip a picture to print on the light material by Focus Composite UV printer without print white ink or varnish. So if you just want print a picture by just a color layer on the material, such as you want print picture on the surface of white ceramic or white other materials without wet ink and varnish. So first we're going to open the reprint software. And before you open the reprint software, you need to insert the blue USB dongle key to your computer. So once you open it, we can see this kind of interface. And on the top of the software, this name the UV without demonstration, the icon. So first, before we rip, we need to be sure the software was set with correct print model. So first we go to the left top icon and we find our print setting. And here we must be sure it's set as Focus Incorporation Company with the print model Epson XP600 plus UV as default. So if it's not, you just choose it and click set as default. Now the setting is okay. Then if we just print a picture with only color layer, so we can import a picture with T format or JPEG. It's better for T format. So we're going to open any picture you want to print. In the USB flash, we have some test print file with T format. So we're going to choose, for example, we want to print this lady on the material. So we choose the file with T format. And we just uh, click OK. And we can set the output size by 300, 300, such as 300. But this must be smaller than 350. And the height must be smaller than 500 millimeter. This is the maximum printing size for Focus Composite UV printer. So after that, we just click OK. And then we go to support color. And we this the first, the first channel is for wet. And the second one is for varnish. And because we don't want to print wet ink and varnish, so we need to choose none. Choose all are close the channel. Now, 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 varnish, now, white. And then click OK. And then we go to choose print. And we choose the ICC profile. This is very important. If you choose the wrong ICC profile, so the color will be different. So here, have lots of ICC profile for a match with different inks. For example, Focus One, CM means Focus Company, CM, CM model UV ink, and the resolution is 720 times 720, and the print speed is 8 pass, and the ink type is hot UV ink. For, for example, right now we use the soft UV ink, so we choose last one. And also here we can choose advanced. Here have ICC on or off. So if you want the ink, if you want to print out quality, the picture is more dark, so you can click on. If you want to print out pictures more shiny, less ink, so you can choose ICC off. Then we click OK. And this one choose a default file custom. And here we choose forward output to print. If, you, if we choose forward output, click on, so the print will start to print from the bottom to top. So if we click off, so the print flow will print from the bottom first, then print the, print, print the top first, then print the bottom. So for normally using, normally see the result quality, we always use forward output. And you can also choose print frame first to make the position, print the frame. If you choose print frame, so if you print only the edge, after print edge, and we put the material on the edge to print the picture. 
So normally, we just uh, if we don't want to print frame, just click on click off to print the full picture on the material. And the horizontal vertical is for print as mineral result. For example, print on a glass, transparent glass or film. So if we print normal on the ceramic, so we just click off as this. Okay, then we click print. For example, we choose the we set as composite test the print file. It's color model. Number two copies. Then we print save. And then we start processing. After finish, we can get a file, SPRN format. This one, property is converted with PRN format. So this is the file we can get after we rip. So after we rip, we can start to print this picture by open the focus, con focus control system to print it. Okay, now must be uh, uh, teach you how to do a coating on the material. For example, now we want to print on the ceramic. It's hard rocket meter. So we need to do the coating on the surface of the ceramic to prevent scratch, to get the best uh, anti-scratch result. So first we need to clean the surface. We use the bottle to push the alcohol and uh, we clean the surface. I've used the clean fabric to be sure the surface is clean without any dust. After that, because it is hard rugged media, so we need to find out the non-metal coating used for ceramic. And we find out the clean tissue fabric. Just one piece is not big. And we open the coating. We just uh, apply a little bit, not too much. When, it's, when it is wet, that's enough. And we do the coating by cycle. We apply by cycle by this way. Be sure all of that was applied equal. Like this. So we apply by cycle position, cycle direction, but not by the pass. If by this way, the lines will be sure of the print. So by this way, and not too much. So after we apply, so we can do the printing. We can put the, move the table to front. And we can put the ceramic on the table. Then we adjust the gap. We move the table inside and we up, move up the carriage. Then we adjust the gap between the print head and ceramic. It's pressed down. Then the gap between the printing head and the ceramic is two millimeter. 
have to be adjust with just the press X home. Then we go to the software and uh, to start print the picture on the ceramic. We go to fire and we just choose the, the, the picture after we rip. Now we just print on print the color picture on the ceramic because the ceramic is white and we don't want, for example, we don't want the embassy 3D life result, so we just print just the color. Six color. Uh, six color because it's six color, so there's no white ink. So we must close the white ink. If we open the white ink and we start print, we get an error message error information, image color mismatch, because picture is this color, and we print by add color, but open. So we need to choose close, and we go to setting parameter, and we set the attribute, test attribute here, we choose the file, and we choose the orange color to print. And also go to setting, and in corrosion, we adjust it to 100% for best quality. If you want more faster, you can reduce a little bit, for example, 70. But we suggest that you're not less than 70% for best quality. Then we go to choose the file. And also we need to be sure the setting, the extended print model, this print width is, is matched with your ink. Then we go to for example, right now we use the, the print on the heart, so we use the soft ink for, for, for demo, so I choose the soft ink. And then we go to choose the file and set in the margin. For example, we want to print the, what we, the ceramic we put on the table is X25, Y40, so we just uh, put X25 Y margin by 40 and I click on the Y margin and we choose print to left or to right and click off the lottery. If you click on the lottery here, it's print on bottle, it's not on flight material. So we need to click off, close it. Then we go to right click and print. So the machine starts to print. And we need to keep the UV control box light on.
Okay, so after print, we can see the print quality. The color is vivid. It was original and resolution. It's high resolution, no any past lines. And you can, even we can see the eyeball. And we'll be taking out the ceramic. You can see the resolution. It's very good. The hair, details, shadow, color. So if you get this good print results, one chip, only seven cents ceramic, you can sell by 20 times is right, the price. You can sell by $10 per one. If you can get the same result as Master B. And also it's anti-scratch, even with scratch their finger, no problem. Even scratch, no problem. It's my key. No problem. It's any scratch and quality good details shadow. So, okay, so this is the procedure to print a uh, wet. Print a picture on the white background without white ink and varnish. Thank you.